Matt and I are in Iceland, and we're getting ready to take off toward the Faroe Islands. It's 6 p.m., and I'm going to do, I have to do my checklist with Joe. Matt's already got his engine started. We go. <laughs> Oops, I went on after starting engine. I gotta go to starting engine before starting. Okay. Fuel pumps off. Run me off. down. Parking oh. brake. Set. All avionics. He sounds like off. Baymax from uh... Fuel Selector. <laughs> Fullest tank. It's still weird. I can battery and alternator we hear your oh, you can hear? things going on over there. Yeah. On. All right. That is. Oh, I'm gonna hit this King Air. Now I gotta start my engine. Let's go over these things, Joe. Mixture. Bridge. Prop RPM lever. Max RPM. Throttle. Full. Fuel boost pump. On until flow peaks, then OFF. Vehicle, Throttle. start moving. Open half an inch. Open half an inch. Magneto slash start switch. All right, clear. Start position. Then Man, I'm not rolling along the ground very well throttle. for some reason. One thousand to twelve hundred RPM. Oil pressure. Check. Take my throttle down just a little bit more there. Okay. After starting the engine, let's get this stuff here, Joey. I'm ready when you are. Switch. What's that? Let's see, what do I On. ready when you are? Lights. Right. Whoa, 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 didn't mean to do that. Uh, okay, let's do strobe beacon. Nav. As required. Ending. Fuel boost pump. Navigules. Check off. Parking brake. It's a temperature outside. Release. It's 50 degrees. It's a warm one. It's t-shirt weather out here. Yeah, it is. Okay. On these lights, we are good. Let's turn on Joe's avionic panel there. All right, we got the MFD, the PFD. Matt's all set and ready. To take off. We, we're no flaps, right? There. Do we know if we have ATIS here? No. What's that? Do we have uh, weather? Oh, that's a good idea. Let's see. Let me see if I can find it on the old uh, four flight real quick. Oh, wrong Let's airport. See. Wrong airport. Uh, let's see, common frequencies, it look like it. Yeah. Do we can try 119.1. I don't think we'll get, no, I don't think we're going to yeah. get any weather. Reykjavik control, 119.7. 119.1. Let me try and see if anything happens there. It's just the CTAF. I guess this guy's kind of, he's kind of here. I guess I'll have him push me back. <laughs> Just because he's going to be in my way if he doesn't. Alright. Um, oh, you're pushing back? Yeah, just a little. Just Alright, I'm going to go out to the runway and I'm actually... Oh, there's a wind sack right there. Okay. Looks like we're going to take off going to the left. Oh, to the south? Girl, then we're, we're right at the beginning of the run. We're right where we need yep. to be then. Then, um... Yep. What was I going to say? Uh, oh, yeah, he pushes me back in a hurry, doesn't he? i got a, a plane right behind me. All right. Um, You're a woman. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Yeah. So, it, what do we we announce take off to the south or is it to the east? What would that, what would that, what would that be? Yeah. We'll be taking off south to the south, departing to the east. Okay. <laughs> Bravo India Hotel, November traffic Beechcraft one five two four Charlie Delta is taxiing to runway. Right, we were right at the beginning of the runway. Perfect. All right. We are set and ready to go. Am I good in my seat? Yeah, I'm good. Back at the at the back of the chair here. All right, Joe, you ready? You got your tray table up. <laughs> We're right at the I beginning of the runway. Phone. What's that? We're right at the beginning of the runway. Yep. All right, taking off runway one eight. All right, I'm gonna. You ready to go? Yeah. A slight wind from the right. I'll line up and wait behind departing aircraft. Okay, fuel pump is on. Here we go. Goes Matt looking good. On his way to the Faroe Islands. <laughs> yeah. 
we're going straight out over the ocean pretty much. It's gonna be a long Okay, flight. 70 knots. What's VR? I'm off the ground. What's that? What's VR? I rotate at like, uh, uh, like uh, 7580 somewhere around there. 7580, okay. Okay, gear's coming up. Uh, Bravo India Hotel, November, traffic yeah. Beechcraft 1524 Charlie Delta, taking off runway 18 departure to the south. <laughs> All right. This looks nice out here. Those mounds up to the right, I mean left. Whatever direction that is. Oh, yeah. Are yeah. you rolling? Is it? I'm rolling, buddy. I'm uh, 77, 78. I'm off the ground that I didn't. And my gear. I didn't even what set. Cars? What's that? I just see a couple cars down the ground down there. All right, sir. What altitude? 8,000? That's a we. Yeah. to send my thing. I'm, I'm stick flying right now. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Come on, come on. 18 for 127. That works for me. Uh, let's go back to heading. Oh, there's nice glassy water here. The glassy water of the South South North Atlantic. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's because we're in this little lagoon. That's right, okay. Oh, yeah. Right over that lagoon right now. Hey. Like you. Oops. That's oh, not what I check I was a little squirrely. Oh boy, oh boy, come on. Seven. Nine, zero, okay. Vertical speed. Eighteen hundred? No, I don't know. I can't climb at 1,800 feet per minute. <laughs> You're at 1,400 right now. Yeah. I'm losing Ooh. some airspeed. All right, I'm going. All right, altitude. I'm climbing at 144 indicated. You are? Yeah. All right. All right. I am on course. Oh, yeah, I got to get back to my nav. All right, turning outbound. Woo. There we are, leaving. See you later, Iceland. Leaving Iceland, yep. The land of ice. Oh, look at the clouds in front of us, uh huh? Yep. I think we might go over those. Oh, look at that mountain oh, up to that, the left. That is cool. Yeah, this I'm getting real good quality here. That is nice. Next time I'm going to have to try the, um, I'm going to go back to the broadcast so my brother-in-law can watch. Uh, yeah, that is cool right there. Yeah, the, diff the texture. The, uh, like the east coast. You can see like the, the loose, the loose soil. Yeah. As it kind of flows over the, the rock and stuff, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's the last, uh, la last buildings we're going to see. Yeah, it's going to be all water here for a while. Yeah. Let me adjust this a little bit. Okay, I'm just about through 4,000. Deployment. Yeah, that is neat. Is your fuel pump still on? Yes, it is. It's still over land right now, thus far. Oh, you are? For a minute, yeah. Yeah, I'm over the water. Let's see here. Oops. Uh, oh, gone. Stupid head tracker. Oh, uh, what happened? Uh, Fall off? No, just the. Uh, I, I, I reset the stupid thing, and then all of a sudden, it didn't. Stick. Yeah. Hey man, I'm, I'm doing 163 ground speed in a climb. That's good news. Look, look at the clouds off to the right there. Yeah. So Ooh. Lean back in my chair. Ooh. That's not it. That's not it. Let's go. Cool. My track, I set up a little bit too 
sensitive and too uh, extreme. Whereas uh, if I just look a little bit to my right, it whips around 180 degrees. Uh, yeah. I'm like, no, I'm just trying to look off my right wing. I'm not trying to look behind me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, this is good. Pretty neat. Let's see, what's your distance to uh, target there? Um, I'm looking at 243.3 nautical miles. Okay, I'm 240.7. Oh, okay. Oh, you're, you're, yeah, you're up a little ways. I'm going... Uh, I'm going, uh, what am I going over the ground? 166? Yeah, I'm 166 also. Okay, I'm climbing. So I'm at 4,800. 4, yeah, 5,500. 5, right, I'm going to change my arc here. All right, I got a 10 nautical mile arc. Looks like we got some some weather out to the uh we, I want to zoom out. i got to see west. this. Whoopsie! Looking at my MFD, I was in a bank. <laughs> Jeez, that was stupid. That is cool. And there it goes, man. Just like that, there goes ice in behind us. Yeah. Let's see. Do I see anything? Oh, yeah. I can still see. I can still see land. Yeah. Obviously. Uh, Alright, just past 6,000, 2,000 feet to go. Looks like we're going over these clouds. Oh, cool. Uh, I don't know what it's going to be like at Faroe Islands when we get there, though. Let's see, I got full oh, yeah. throttle, 20, 23.6 inches of mercury. Starting to climb a little slower here. Oh, yeah, yeah let me get back to BY. Well, I'll put some cabin heat on here. I'll be at 34 degrees. I'm going to climb like a rocket now. All right. Uh, hold on a second here. i got to get comfortable. It's going to be a while. Uh. All right. What do we got for ATC? Nothing. It's Reykjavik Center. All right, just tuning them in. I'm not going to do flight following. 7,000. i got 1,000 feet to go. If we stalled out, we might be able to make it back to land, no? <laughs> um, let's see, I'm at 140 knots indicated. 58. 6,500 feet. Alright, let's get it. Alright, here we here. go. I'm just about at, uh, who's it what now? Through the clouds, here's some VR cloud flying. <laughs> yeah, so I think we're gonna be over these clouds that are directly ahead of me. Yeah, we gotta be. I think we might just hit the wispy tops of them. I don't know. What's your distance? Uh, 232.4. 234.5. I'm looking to see if I can see you. Yeah, I'm leveling up and picking up speed. Oh, I see you. I don't know if my cursor is lined up, but that's right there. It's a speck. Yeah, I think it'll be good altitude to fly it. Yeah, let's see here. What do we got? Uh, okay, 7,900 feet. Will it be? Will it be dark when we land, or not? No, I don't think so. Be, be I think it'll be a nice because it's still plenty sunset. of uh, <clears throat> sun's still plenty high right now. It's like still pretty bright out. Yeah. Let's see. How's my altitude and all that crap doing here? So south is like that. Well, yeah. So we got we got weather to the southwest. Take gears up. Now I'm gonna work on 
mixture. Oh, yeah. my prop pack, 2,500. Yeah, I'm at 7,800, so I'm gonna get my paint flow. Okay, engine. Fuel pump is off. Lean. What's your What are your throttles setting? You get 20. Full throttle, 22.1. Oh, okay. And I'm exactly 2,500 RPM. Yeah, I'm exactly 2,500 RPM. I'm 22. Yeah, I'm 22.1. Oh, you're 22.0? Yeah, I can't get any more out of it. Let's see, 1070, 1030, 1025. I'm going to set my leaning now. 1015, okay, yeah, 1015, that's the one I'm going to work with. I can get 18.5. Let's see, 1070, 1085, 1090, 1100. 11. I am coast. I'm not, technically, I'm I'm still VR compliant. I'm not in the clouds. But I am going right past them. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go to 1045. Oh, there's some, you see those little specks of orange out there? Yeah. Uh, next red? Yeah. The hell that is? Lightning. It's like, I don't know what that is. That's just, it's really, it's really condensed, right? I mean, it's yeah. heavy rain or, or, or something, I guess. Up here, it's 28 degrees up here, so it's, it's frozen I up am here. leaned out. I'm leaning to 18.5 gallons per hour. Yeah, me too. And I'm doing, what's your ground speed? Um, Ground speed. Uh, 181. Yeah, that's what I got. All right, and I I could see. I think I see you. I saw you before. You're out there somewhere. What's your distance? Uh, let's see. I'm 222.4. 224.8. All right, so you're two and a half miles ahead of me. Those nasty little clouds off to the right there, below us, kind of. Yeah, right. That's where the action's at. <laughs> you go in there, do a barrel roll. Yeah, it's getting, uh, it didn't look like this when we took off. Get oh, ooh, there's some, there's some gray, chunky looking stuff off to the left, too. Something was flashing on my map back there. I don't know what that was. Okay, let's that see, 127, okay, that looks good, that looks good. Pedo heat is off, 29 degrees out, ooh, it's freezing. Yeah. Yep, yep. Up here at 8,000 feet, let's see. Let me, let me do my cow flap, see if I can pick up a little speed. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah, I'm going to close them, open them. Or open them and then close them again. Can I move? Three, I think I did. No, I didn't. I'm going to go I'm gonna go sit back in the back for a little bit. How do you do that? Alt, uh, alt back arrow. Uh, I'm on, I'm yeah. on, um, on what's it called? You just jumped in the back seat, huh? Yeah. I'm on autopilot. Oh, I see. So I, I, I see how you I did it. it. Oh, I didn't know you could zoom for. Oh, that's just like zooming in, forward yeah. and out. Yeah. I do so, that, I can do that with my mouse wheel. Yeah, so this is, this is what it's like to sit here at the back table. We got a cup rest back here. Good. Be a little taller than that. You know, the low seats. See, is it got a table that pulls out on the right side too? Unlocked, locked, no. Oh, that's no. the door. Uh, yeah, there's the oh, yeah, you put your magazines in there and stuff. This would be where you play blackjack. Fold them up. Okay. Two person blackjack. <laughs> so we got, okay, we got the rear seat. Yes, yeah, so a six seater G36. What's a G36? That's what this plane is, being a Bonanza G36. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know if we could turn on the lights back here or not. Uh, uh, no, it doesn't look like I can. Wait, the, the ceiling ones? Oh, yeah, I yeah. can't. Uh, nope, you can't. Oh, yeah, you can. The switch is um, up up near the pilot. In the, oh, it is? Oh, okay. The, at the okay, roof. There, you could do it? Okay. Yeah. I'll have to try this on VR sometime. 
What's this switch do? Oh yeah, the Miller lights. I'm still working. I get the VR thing right. I, it, it's working better, uh -huh. but it's. I know. I've seen people online who have lesser card than I do, and um, and get better performance. Oh, yeah, <laughs> with the same VR headset as you. Uh, I don't know if they have the same VR headset. If they've got the Oculus too. Uh huh. But uh, when it works, though, it is cool because you get this. You get the feeling that you know it all surrounds you. It's it's pretty darn neat. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's see. We're eight thousand feet. You can just yeah, make out uh, some white caps down there. Uh, Little ones. Oh see yeah. The, the ripple of the the water. That's still cool. All you can see is just kind of the contours of the water. Yeah. Just kind of like. And I don't think I think I'm not quite ultra setting. Sorry. I had to pull a couple things back, but no. Mm -hmm. For the most Let's part. Let's see. My, my CHTs are good. Um, how, uh, let's see, fuel we just started. Should you need any fuel switching yet? I can still see Iceland back there. What a different experience as far as the card goes. When I started this to where, to where we are now, Yeah. I mean, it was just such a choppy mess. Yeah, well, so right now, when you if you just look around, just normal looking around, it's all perfectly smooth? Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. cool. I mean, I know it, it's perfectly smooth for me in-game, and I think I think it translates about as well on on the video. Um, yeah. But uh, these are some low some low seats back here. I, I would like a different colored interior. This tan, you know, a different what? Different colored interior. This... Like oh. you know, tapioca. Oh yeah, <laughs> your, your interior is different looking than mine. Yeah. Oh, here's a spot for that. Do you have carpeted floor, or do you got some kind of vinyl got, or something? I got carpeted. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like oatmeal. It looks yeah. like oatmeal yeah. carpet. <laughs> I've got the thing on the side here for my um, on the on the left side here. I've got you know headphones and microphone plus my drink holder. Hey, what color do you say your seats are? Your leather seats. It's like a tapioca kind of a. You know, like a. I don't know what's the word. Is that like a brown tan? Kind yeah. Of? Yeah. That's what mine is. Yeah, like what's what's a butterscotch? <laughs> yeah. Let's see now. Eight thousand feet over the North Atlantic again, middle of. Uh, we're we're just living by you know living dangerously again. On the right side here. Flying over no man's land, Atlantic. Yeah. Look at this big old riser cloud off to the left here. Oh yeah! Wow! Yeah. You see it? Yeah. I, I'm assuming you see the same. That's interesting at, that it's, it puts the same clouds. Yeah. Do we it's see like, the same thing? It's like at 11 o'clock. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that thing looks uh, crunchy. Yeah, I don't know how, how much I'd want to be a passenger in this thing. I mean, it works. It's free. I'm going through a cloud right now, like little wisps of cloud. All right, so now how do I get back up to the front? I guess I got to. Uh, get You're still sitting in the back. Yeah. 29 degrees out here. Can climb through the middle. Excuse me. You know what? I didn't do anything with my trim. Back up a little. Oh, this is this is good. Right where I'm at. It's flying pretty well. Oh boy. So we're just a, we're almost we're almost wrapping up this uh, this North Atlantic trip, man. Yeah, yeah, I know. About the yeah. end. Well, when we get to so we land in Scotland. What part of Scotland are we supposed to be going to? I was gonna go to um, Wick. To what? Wick. You keep we're going you, to Faroe Islands right now. Yeah, I mean you keep dropping out when you say. Oh, Wick. W I C K. Wick. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Um, Let's see, we got through those clouds. I'm going to look that up on my phone real quick. Those keeping score. Wick. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. 
Oh, looks like we might have a little wider up here. Scotland. All right, and that is... Okay, so it's eastern. Oh, it's northern. Oh, that's like... Yeah, in yeah. Okay, let's switch tanks here. So, oh yeah, there's a nice airport there. Yeah. Oh, at Wick? Yeah. Old, yeah, old airport. I think it's base. an old World War II we have yeah. base. RAF. Yeah, it looks like two of the runways are uh, are no longer in use. At least they got big X's on them. Uh huh. Yeah. So I guess they don't need a three runway airport. <laughs> Little town that's that's like you know ten thousand people. Yeah. Oh, but maybe, but maybe we should go to Elgin, just uh -huh. to, yeah. just so we could say we went from we can make the to Elgin. Yeah. <laughs> how far? I didn't I didn't look at the map. How it's far? It's right. Uh, it's right across the Firth, the Fourth or whatever that is. It's, oh, okay. Yeah, there you it's go. Like, it's probably twenty miles south. Let's see, twenty. Yeah. Um, Ooh, we might hit somebody. Oh, look ahead of us, man. We might get into these clouds. It might get a little ugly. Uh, I'm not getting anything on ATIS anyway. 122.7. I'm going to just guess that... Uh, Man, 113.9. You know what? I can fake it. I can probably, I think I can cheat and see if, not cheat, but force this thing to give me, if I reactivate the approach procedure. Damn, I don't know if it did it or not. Let's try this. One more time here. Procedure. Activate maybe, approach. Maybe about 50 miles. Yeah, 20 more miles. I get to 50. Those are really. Oh, uh, no. Hey. Yep. Um, you activated your approach, right? Yes. Look up in your EFD, upper left corner, the nav frequencies up there. Uh, in nav the 1, top row. Oh, yeah. Nav, I got 110.5. On the left. Okay, what's the other one? 110.3. 110.3 and 110.5. Yeah. 110.5 is probably the localizer. Oh, okay. It's it's in the square. It's in the magenta. It's in the um, right. yeah. not magenta. It's in the sign. Whatever. The, whatever. Yep. 1105. Okay, so let's see. So, you know, right we'll now, see. I got GPS on my thing down there. Do I, when I get, when I'm getting in on the, um, on a localizer, do I need to switch? Yeah. What would I click to? CDI turn? button. See, it keeps switching in until I, it says, okay. Yep, switch until it says localizer one. Okay. But only when I'm on final. Yeah, so when you get, when you get to the final approach fix, when, what are the, when, no, when you get the initial approach fix, uh, oh, I'm getting ATIS right now. Oh, you are? Yep. Sorry, when you get to the final approach fix, yeah, final approach fix, then you should be on the green. You're, you're a couple miles ahead of me, maybe. Maybe you're just going to pick it up soon. How many, how far out are you? 3015 for the altimeter. Uh, how, how far out are you? I am 61.9 miles away. Oh, okay, all right, all right. So I'm two miles behind you, so 20 minutes, 20 and a half minutes, and then Mission golf. top of descent, 13. 15. All right, so I'll change. Well, let's see here. It's that guy. We can 222 at 9. Heavy rain. <laughs> Great. At 9 knots. 
This is gonna be a good one. <laughs> oh we have yes. A, we have a, cro a nine knot crosswind. I have three zeros in use. Oh good. Because that's what we're using. Hey. Have you with overcast down to low? Oh man, I hope that one twenty ten point five is. Well, uh, I mean, why would we expect anything different, right? Uh -huh. I, mean, I think I think we had a one yeah. clear landing this whole, maybe two. This whole uh, adventure. Well, let's see, okay, guys. let's clear that out. Can I get ADIS now? Anyone? Ah, Vagar EKVG, right? Yeah, there we go. Tune in traffic. I can tune in traffic, but I can't tune in ADIS. Nav two. What the hell is that doing? Man, I hope that 110.5 is it. Traffic Beechcraft, 1524 Charlie Delta Tree, 7 miles northwest, 8,000 feet inbound to land runway tree 0. Nobody knows. Oh, I see I see the island. Oh, on, uh, oh, I see it. Yeah, yeah, about one yep. of, Yeah, about, well, just 1230. Yeah. 55 miles out. Wow, that's 55 miles away. Oh wait, there's a there's a couple islands. So there's one directly off my nose, but then you see one at about twelve or uh, well twelve thirty. So I, I changed the barometer. I got three zero point one one. Is that? Yeah, I'm three zero one five. That's what the ADA said. Oh okay. Hey, is there? Do you see land in yeah. between clouds off to the? Oh wait a second. Yeah, this land is right here. Yeah. Right off to the, like at 11 o'clock, 10.30, 11 o'clock? That's it, it was the clouds, you can see it? Yeah. I see a little island directly in front of me. Yeah. Hey, hey a little bit that? more to your left, that's right. Yeah, okay. What oh, we got going on over here? We are within sight. I'm going to take it down to 4,000 feet, because I want to. Because you want to? I'm not a Todd yet. <laughs> Yeah, I got I got a lot more. Minutes. I want to get below these clouds and get some visibility action going on here. Okay, let's see. Let's go down. I want to get my landing lights and my other stuff on there. So turn that crap off, dude. All right, heading down. Oh man, I might be going right through this clock. Heavy rain. Let's see, we'll go 17 inches here. I'm going to be going right through this cloud, unfortunately. Oh, well. It's funny to think that Scotland is south of us. <laughs> that is maybe a pretty far north. Okay, where's my mixture? Mixture is going to... We've been flying southeast for a long time. It's reaching it up a little bit here. I see you. Do you see me below you? Yeah. Yeah, 7,000 feet right now. Yeah, maybe I should start coming down as well. Doing 183 feet over the ground. And I'm 40, I'm still 48, 46 miles out. So I'm still. Yeah, definitely got some land in sight here. There's a little island up the uh, one o'clock over here. Yeah, because I can start coming down beneath the clouds anyway. There, it looks like there's some terrain here. The islands are not flat.
What's your altitude right now? Um, yeah, I'm about to go through a cloud. My uh, oh, I can see all the sorts of approach. I can see the missed approach. Yeah. Back. I'm assuming you know. I'm more I'm just that. I'm at 7,600 feet still. I just started coming down. Yeah. 27, 129. What's your okay. ground? What's your ground speed? Number 178. I'm 191. <laughs> What's your distance? You might overtake me a little bit here. Uh, I'm I'm 44.3. Okay, I'm 42.1. All right, I guess maybe I should slow down then, because I don't I I want you to go in first. Okay, what do we got out here? We got. Uh, that little island there, damn it, unfortunately I'm gonna go into this cloud. It's okay. Should be back. Change my mixture a little bit there. So, I, I call in traffic, but isn't it a towered? No. No. I don't think they have a tower. Oh. No, they don't. Common center, nope. So all you get is CTAP, which is, uh, I don't even know. Well, that, that, uh, the land looks like it really juts up. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're getting a little, we're getting some nice shadows here. It's getting a little, uh, orangey, but not, not too much anyway. Anyway, but yeah, there's, uh, there's still terrain here, man. We'll see what's going on on these clouds. It looks like I might go into a cloud and I might never come out right now. <laughs> okay, oh, I got a better glimpse of the land in front of me here. This is for all the money. <laughs> hey, I don't think it's going to be heavy rain though, unless yeah, it doesn't look it, that heavy rain right now. Maybe it's changed. Let me listen to that anus and see what that guy knows what yeah. he's talking about. Thousand seven hundred feet overcast, heavy rain. Okay, so one thousand seven hundred feet. That's not bad. No. Hey, this uh, these mountains don't look very textured very right. well. Not yet. Maybe they'll dry. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe closer. Okay, I'm uh, getting ready to begin my approach here. Yeah, I'm starting to get a little bit more detail on the closest approach course. Is probably three zero zero. It's going to be close enough. I don't know. Does that okay, CDI so button work? So it looks like we, so EKBG, that's, that's where we're ending up? Yeah. All right, so we're going to fly a right pattern, basically. Well, sort of. what the approach says to do. Yeah. Uh, 130, 129. Okay. Yeah, because my, my, my path I'm on right now is, um, you know, west or east of the, of the airport. And then it looks like we caught to around the back. Yeah, it looks like we're doing something right. Uh, okay, so 4,500. I'm going to keep it right there for right now. Coming in through a cloud. Island off to the right, that's kind of cool. Looks like Catalina Island. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, this is cool, man. There's like little lakes and in, in these little... Uh, Barrel Islands. 30, it says I'm 33 nautical miles out from the turn. 1.7. Alright, so this airport is... It got... Just Wait, how are we that far out? 33. Yeah, yeah alright. Whatever. Past this. So this thing is like... Uh, if I'm looking at those... Things, looking at that island there. It's just inside that little lake on the right. It's just this side of it. Yeah, so we're passing the airport right now, kind of. Well, right? we will. What are we, no, what are it's, we doing? It's, it's at about your probably 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock rock. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at the missed approach point. Yeah. Yeah. The 
Let's see, what do we got coming up here? Let's zoom in a little bit more. I can see you. I'm closing on you. you shoot me down? Yeah. Okay, 4,000 feet. I'm staying at four, about 4,200 right now. That's fine. Doing 19 inches. I'm going to go to 18 inches here. 2,500 RPM. At 5,000. What's your ground speed? What are you doing? Uh, ground speed is 174. <clears throat> you might catch up to me a little bit. I'm doing 160. You got you got 17. Oh, I went up to 18. I haven't been riding my throttle. It, it, climbed, it climbed because you were descending, right? Yeah. I got. I, I gotta, think I see the airport right down there. I got to change my mixture too. I think that little valley over there is where the airport is. I don't know. Maybe. I'm at, yeah, I'm this does not look. There's no. There's no heavy rain here. I'm. I'm full rich. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna get a scenic landing after all. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There's the airport. You actually see it? Uh, yeah, I do. Oh, I see it. Yeah, yeah it looks like a green strip, kind of. Look for a straight line. Yeah, just south I see of, it. Or just, just north. Uh, west of the yeah. lake there. Now I lost you. Where the heck are you? Because you like yeah, it's taking us way out there for this approach. That's all right. Line for only three zero. I'm gonna announce him on the downwind. Twenty four miles just to Roper. Kilo Victor Golf Traffic Beechcraft One Five Two Four Charlie Delta is on downwind runway three zero. There it is. Yep. Where's yeah? Where's mine looks. I got the, I got the cut. Oh look. At there's stupid little jagged spikes that appeared, oh. like a, an artifact. Oh, there's a bunch of them right now. Look up your right wing down there. Are you seeing them? Or maybe they'll draw it for you uh, as you get a little closer. They're like an error, like we saw in Iceland, you know? Like, oh. oh, yeah, kind of like a... Oh, yeah, they're still there. Points of rock picking up. Where's, okay, there's the town. Yeah. It's like a nice and green on my uh yeah my scenery yeah me too <clears throat> I see where they want you feet. Feet. good looking scenery here yeah. oh there's the airport What's your, uh, what altitude are you at now? <coughs> excuse me I'm at 4000 okay it's a nice little inlet over here off the left side yeah, that's kind of cool. Actually, by the water looks all smooth. Yeah. Oh, there's some windmills out there. To the left. Yeah. Straight off the left wing, look that off in the distance. I got three windmills yeah, out there nice. on a ridge. Well, I actually want this screenshot. Oh, there Still you are. Least. You're off my right wing. Oh yeah. Let's see where the hell are you? Oh, there's somebody. Hold on a second. Are you... Are you on the approach still? Yeah, I'm on the approach. I'm heading to Rober still. Oh, no, okay. Someone else is off my right wing. Huh. I don't know if it's an actual person or... Boy. It's going to get cozy. Ooh, I dropped below 4,000. Whoopsie. All right, where are we at? So we take a sharp bank to the right once we get up there. Yeah, it looks like it. And I'm going to stay on GPS all the way until the final approach fix. Yeah. So do these cliffs, these cliff faces, like in this inlet, do yeah. they look a little, little, little bit generic? Yeah. Yeah. Right off your left, yeah, it looks a little... Right. But, uh, but the... The interior of those, the the mountains that are just off a little bit there, they've got some texture to them, like some erosion, you know, some vertical erosion channels. That's pretty cool. This would be a neat place to visit. Oh yeah, it's just be super cool. Wide open. We have those little uh, shack on top of that peak off our left wing. Little oh. houses up there or something. Oh yeah, right up at the top, like an observatory or something. Yeah, yeah. 
Rest of my windmills at about 11 o'clock. Oh, yeah. 15 miles to the turn still here. Wow. Yeah, they're Impressive really, approach. They want you, but that heavy rain forecasting you got was just a load of... Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to listen to it again and see if they're still... On a... That's funny. You have it, though. Like, I should be able to get it to the ATC panel if it's available. But it doesn't show up. It's six in heavy rain. And they're saying overcast. I don't see any of that. Yeah. What do they think we're landing like 30 miles to the north? <laughs> All right. You still see me in front of you? Or do you see me at all? <laughs> yeah, I saw. Uh, oh, you? Yeah, there you are. I How think. far are you from Rober? Uh, from Rober, I am 15. We got 13.5. Okay. Yeah, we'll be able to see each other really good when you when you turn. Yeah. This is, this scenery is cool, man. This place looks cool. Yeah. All little, uh, peninsulas and inlets and stuff. Yeah, and there's like chunks of little islands. We need to get a like a sailboat and just yeah. Go from, well, there's like some farming down there to the left. Look, at least I see some. Some roads and paths. Yeah, there's, it's like a bunch of little Catalinas all glued together. Oh, and there's uh, like they got like windmills, like uh, wind generators yeah. or wind turbines. Yep. Wind generators. Yeah. The big fans. <laughs> to make it wind. Just turn them off. You turn them off until we, until we land. I'm living it. The wind's like 100 miles an hour when they turn those things on. Sucks. Yeah, this neat looking plateau here. Yeah, there's a little town, this little town off our uh, 10 o'clock there. Oh, yeah. yeah inlet. So, oh, this is the place with all the football fields. Oh. That's right, we got to start looking for some pitch. Cheer on the local team as we're flying over. <laughs> and then go to the next village and cheer on their team. Right. A little canyon right, there. 10 miles, 10 miles to the turn, it looks like. There'll be some good rock climbing here, I mean. EOD. Okay, let's see. Yeah, there's the the Hamlet. Now this thing is actually uh, okay. Turn three zero two in one second. Okay, we'll do. I'm turning hard. You're doing it manually, or is it is it oh, yeah. guide? Oh, I mean it should guide me in though, shouldn't it? If I'm on autopilot. I suppose so. Don't see you. Oh, well, there you are. Yeah, I see you making your turn. You're right over my comp magnetic compass now. Three zero two. You see me at your nine at your three o'clock? Not yet, but when I level out, I might get you. Uh, Standard rate turn. Looking good. Oh, I'm banking. Oh, it's turning you. Yeah. Oh, right into the sun, too. This is going to be nice. This is Oh, you got to get a picture of this shot. Uh, Turn back on course. It's cool looking. Yeah. 303 in four seconds. Okay. Are you going to get a picture? There's Matt going around. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, this is Let's see, are you, are you a beam of me, or where are you at? I'm turning in behind you. Okay. This, this must be volcanic stuff, right? Because this is like a loaf of land just jutting up in front of you there. Yeah. All right, Joe, you ready? We got, we got. What lady. was the final approach fix here? Is it 101, 101, 111, something, something? Something or other. Something yeah. like that. Yeah, I don't have a checklist for landing. Check my nav log. Okay, I'm going full rich. Fuel pumps on. Mixture there or there. All right, all right, now I see localizer stuff this so I should change my oh well, my CDI changed to localizer for me. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna change mine then now too. Let's see. What? Oh, wrong button. Like it changed it for me. What is an approach course? It's probably three zero zero. I don't have a localizer yet. I must be on the wrong freaking frequency. One ten point five. I don't know what the right frequency is. Uh, this is a problem. The airport. I'm gonna. I need to zoom in a little bit here. 
unless I'm just too far. Oh, I'm too far out for that. Forget that. I'm going back. Too far out to pick up the. Ed, I stay at four thousand. Do I do I switch to approach now? No, you stay at four thousand. Stay at four thousand till the final approach fix. Okay, I clicked on approach. This should just lock me in. Now I want to. Do I want to be on flaps now that I'm final? I mean, I'm. You can start. You, can, you can slow down to get into flaps range. You're probably not in flaps range yet, yeah. right? You can put your gear down to slow down. Start getting fully configured. I don't want to tell them I'm on final. Echo Kilo Victor Golf Traffic Beechcraft 1524 Charlie Delta is on final runway tree zero to land. Okay. Looks like I'm flying the uh, flaps here. Why do I not have a localizer yet? And I want to be on final at like 85 knots or? Uh, yeah, 80 knots. Yeah, 80, 85. That's good. Okay, gear's coming down. I'm winging this because I don't know what the localizer frequency is, so I'm just basically flying this visual now. Ooh, a little chop there. I can see the runway now. Yep. Good. We'll do one more. Ooh, 15. Come back off the thing a little bit there. It looks like looks like I'm on the localizer now. So I, yeah, I got to come back a little. I'm a little fast for the flaps. One more. You actually have you're green. Do you have a needle? Uh, yeah. I mean, I got yeah. Center needle on a, a needle to center yourself by, not the one that points to it. Heading, but I have no. It says local. It needle. says local one. Yeah, but there's no center part of it. There's no center guidance needle. Do you have one? Uh, center yeah. Center part of your needle. Yeah. Uh, see, so yeah, I must be on the wrong frequency. What are your What are your nav one frequencies? What do you say up there? Oh, uh, I see. One ten point five. One one zero point five on the left, and it's highlighted in the box. One one zero point three on the right. One one zero point three. Okay, let me yeah. try that. And I've got the diamond. I got the green diamond on the right, and the. One one zero point three. Okay, CDI. Yeah, we are, I'm coming, I am descending. I'm at 3,000 feet now. Yeah, that, okay. There we go, that's what it was. I'm 118 indicated. Localizer. And I'm way high. Once I get Let's a little closer to this here. next land, I'm gonna, yeah, I don't have full flaps yet. Way above my local, my glide. Right, I'm going to come down one more on the flaps and drop my gear. And get myself to 80, 80 knots, you said? Yeah. Put your 80. Or 85. I do 80. is going to be from the left. I see you, yep. Yeah. I'm crab walking to the right a little bit, though, it looks like. Four knots. I'm going to go final full flap. Oh, I am full flap. I guess that's, I guess I only have two, two layers of flaps. This ILS approach takes you right over this cliff. my glide slope. There you are. Hi. <laughs> I'm right on the diamond. Yeah, see here's the the localizer has me lined up. The, the approach is doing it right. <laughs> and this one has the diamond here and it looks like this this wants to pick me up. I I've, I've got a little chop I think coming off that cliff. Yep. And here's a town just just to the east south east of the airport that I got to fly over. I don't know if it's a town or if that's just a nice How looking approach. There's some more community down there. I think there's soccer fields down here, right? <laughs> yeah. Pretty neat. Let's 
kind of cool. We're in the Faroe Islands, people. We're almost we're coming in. I'm at 90 now, it's gotta come back a little bit. You landing right now? I touched down. Very nice. You got plenty of room. I'm uh, I'm two nautical miles out. It's got, it's, I got these, have you seen these spikes? These like artifact spike things up on the, on the cliff to your, the right? Uh, this is cool, right into the sun, it's, yeah. it's pretty cool looking. I, I see cars driving down the road now. It's, uh, runway's a little uphill here. This is the gas. Okay, I'm taking the uh, taxiway Alpha here. Yeah, it's annoying how my brakes are either full on or full off. Other than missed approach point. It's a nice, it's a nice terminal. Loop flopping. Seventy-seven knots. This thing's right off the water. Five hundred. Five hundred feet. Are you off the runway yet? Yeah, I'm totally off it. Totally. I don't even want to talk about it. about to take it off autopilot and guide it in the rest of the way here. Let's see, what do we got here? The wind is from the... From I see you over there. down, flaps back up, and yeah. you're... I don't even have to use my brakes. Yeah, you're going, looks a little uphill, right? Yeah, yeah my, my airport's pretty nicely detailed. Oh, well, you'll have to check mine out to see, I mean, it's it's not, yeah. the, I'm sure yours is more detailed, but this isn't bad for, you know, stock. Yeah. It's, uh, Only I thing do that sucks is these, uh, Little spike things up on the cliff up there. It looks I've, a little stupid. I got an artifact. There's a plane that's. Is that you? Uh, yeah, I'm off to your right there. Okay, because yeah. it looks like you're in the air. You're just with no landing gear? Yeah, yeah. No, yeah, like you, you're, you're, no, you're yeah, you pulling in. You have no landing gear either. Oh, there you go. You're you so I mean, like you're Traffic above me. One, five, two, four, Charlie Delta. Is clear of the you're runway. floating about 20 feet off the ground. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I don't see. Okay, oh, there's my crew. I missed my turn. Hold on, I gotta turn back around here. I'm uh, my my ground crew's right here. Hold on, whoops. Sorry. Vaga Floghaven. I'm pulling right up to the terminal here, like American well, Airlines. I guess that's an artifact. If you if you've got this thing and I don't, it looks like you're hovering 20 feet above the ground. That's probably what it is. Yeah. yeah. So even right now, my plane looks like it's higher. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that must be what it is. Is that I got the airport and you don't? Yeah. <laughs> All right, here's my guy. Right over by the fuel. Hey, that was a nice flight. Yeah. You killed it. I like this. I like this airport that I. Yeah, it looks it looks good. Oh, yeah, I know I missed this. I missed this. I see. I, I can see. I missed it. So, does your what would you would you say yours looks kind of generic, or does it look pretty detailed and pretty good? Um, hold on one second. I just got to scoot up here a little As bit. A whole. He's telling me to cut. Put my brakes on. All right. Uh, no, it looks it looks <laughs> except for your plane floating there. It looks good. I mean, uh, you know, the buildings are boxy. Uh, I don't see jetways. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mine looks really good and architectural and glass and <coughs> red red lines as taxiway markers and yellow lines and stuff. It's, it's cool. All right, let me. Here, turn I'll send off. you a. I'll send you a screenshot of this thing right now. There you go. Maybe. Baby. All right, we're gonna kill it with the mixture. And we're gonna get our thing here. An hour and thirty nine minutes. 
in five seconds. All day. I gotta do some night flight. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna cut. My yeah. Out. Tim alternators. My battery. Turn my key off and step out. <clears throat> oh, why is it like angled? Yeah. So here we are. Uh, the mat's floating above the ground. I'm on the ground. Wait, this is this is maybe a bad one. Maybe we should go. Oh, oh, cool. Here's the tail one. Yeah, we're <laughs> that's Matt's aircraft floating. We're in the Pharaohs. I hold on. There we go. I won't look at his plane. But this is pretty neat. The sun's just now going down. That was a yeah. nice flight. And the weather's so clear. Your whole thing yep. about stormy. <laughs> I don't know what that's all about. Yeah, heavy rain. Uh, yeah, see, this I, I like flying at this time when it's like, look at that man. Look to the north, or not, not the north, the west. Sun setting right in between those valleys. Oh and, uh, yeah, mountains with that inlet. Uh, yeah. is, I want to go to this airport right now. <laughs> that is cool. Yeah, so the next time we fly, we'll we'll head down to we'll hit northern Scotland, and then the so we got two more legs. Yep. And then maybe we could do another one this weekend or something. All right. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Bye.